What's going on guys? Bow here back with some anime ninjas. So let's get into this here. We're gonna be checking out the new events. We did miss the last event, which is fine, of course. Um, because we're still sort of racking in the gold. We don't have that much gold to spend, and then we also have to wait two months for the next plan anyway. Uh we do have a few different events going on. I don't know if I'm gonna be doing any of these just because like i said we don't have that much gold um first off i guess we'll just start off with the anniversary celebration which gives us quite a bit of stuff um that you can actually get you basically get some free celebration stuff which is timed and then you just grab it of course um and then Depending on your top up, you can get some extra gold and stuff like that as well. And then we have a character, we have pets, we have just a ton of stuff in this event. Although I don't even have enough gold. Um, currently we're at 22k, we do have some in the mail because of the plan of course. Um, we have 13 more left of 4,000. Uh, I can grab all of these real quick and see how much we actually have. My bag is full. Never mind. I guess we're gonna have to uh, figure out why my bag is full. I'm not too sure. I mean, I do have quite a bit of stuff in my bag. Damn, it's always full. There's never any space. I have 380. Maybe accessories? Oh yeah, accessories are taking up uh, a little bit of space. Might get rid of some of those. This weapon's not taking up that much. Maybe Jane? Maybe it's the Jade. Not too sure. Um, let me see. Let me go here real quick. Uh, yeah, we do have a few events and stuff like that. Maybe I should get rid of some of these. I mean, I'm, I do want to keep them. I do want to get a character at some point, maybe. Maybe get some more sets. Um... I don't really play anymore. I just play every once in a while. Uh, we didn't pass up the gold last time. We're doing this time though. And uh, get rid of these three. Almost got rid of that, which we need. Keeping those just because we do need them for. Um, I still need to make certain sets, which I need to go back and farm the materials for, which kind of sucks. Really wish we could buy more space though. We don't really have that much. Hmm. I mean, we have a level 8 box for some reason, so I guess we gotta open that up. And of course, it takes up space. Um, yeah, we don't really have... I'm gonna have that and stuff like that. What is taking up all the space? It's gotta be Jade. I mean, the materials, yes, but I think most of it is the Jade, I guess? Should've probably did this before we started the video but I haven't made one in a while so that's fine we'll go level five just because I know we can get a ton of them to higher rankings and uh, yeah I mean this event we do have a character I I don't know if I'm gonna be getting them or not honestly like I could but Counter? Should we do counter? Yes, let's do counter. Alright, let me see which ones I have that I can actually upgrade. That's 11 of those. I actually have 12 of those. Let's upgrade that because that'll be a perfect amount. We're looking for like, if this had one more I would have done it. Um, level 6 is, we can do that one real quick. Just trying to make room. Uh, yeah, I have a ton of uh, Jade currently. It may look like a lot, it's really not because most of mines are level 10, level 11, so we're looking for some level 12s. Um, that's why they're just sitting there, honestly. What is this one? Level 6s? Let's just get that up one. And then I think we're good. I mean, we could do the S attack, but it it's, wouldn't matter on that one. Um, level 5. I can do these just to get to level 5. There we go. All right, we should have a little bit more room. Yeah, definitely have a lot more room. Let's actually grab the bag real quick. And then, uh, like I said, we still have 14, or 14, 13 times four of the gold coming in. So 
That should be quite a bit. Bag is full again? What? Bag is not full. Why is it saying bag full? Is it because I have all this stuff in here? I'm gonna have to loot all this stuff, aren't I? Damn it. Why? Why can't we get more bag space? Honestly, it's like not that hard to give us more bag space. I mean, we do get more, but you gotta have uh, the higher VIP levels, which is kind of, I guess I understand it, but with the amount of stuff they keep adding in and stuff like that, they need to add more space in general. Like they, they give us a little bit and they're just like, yep, yeah, you gotta do top up for it though. But the amount of bag space has been the same since, uh, well, I mean, they did add a little bit in a long time ago, but they need to do a lot more than just add in four. I think you can get like 400 and something. It should be at least a thousand or something like that with the amount of stuff that they add in. Like all of this stuff is new. Like all, like there's so much stuff that is new. Like it doesn't make any sense not to add. Um, damn it, I am pretty much just use that, that out of the way, can we use these, no, let's just get these boxes out of the way I think, I should, I mean we do have some jade we could probably level up because I did pluck a little bit more, oh my god how much stuff do we have, I know it's the material, it, it has to be. All right, let's see if we can do some more jade real quick. We haven't even got into the video. Um, I should actually show you guys the character first. Hold up. What? Oh, because we have no space. This is so stupid. Expand. It's going to cost me 1100 coupon. All right, we're just going to buy it. 1300 let's get rid of all of these I might just buy another thing of space too we have 24 of these times 200 for the coupons I don't want to spend that but we end up spending it anyway we have two spaces oh my god this better let us grab this stuff seriously there we go. Oh my god. Apparently our bag has been full for a while. There we go. Sheesh, we had to spend a little bit just to get that done. Um, yeah, we have Jade and stuff like that. Anyway, we have the uh, anniversary one. We got the new character. We do have 50k gold currently. And uh, we'll get another 50, I think 51 or 52,000 from the 4,000 that still hasn't come in for the over the next 13 days. So we have 100 and, I think 101 or 102,000. We'll just say 100,000. Uh, we're going to keep 50k of which, like we always do. Um, so that leaves us 50k, which we can get this character. It is an assaulter. It is the Sasuke, Kono Shadow Sasuke. Um, it is an assaulter though. I kind of want to support, but let's check out the attack and stuff like that, or the skills and talents. Attack all enemies at 330% growth rate, 100% chance to bleed enemies for one round for two, or by 100% for two rounds. So dot damage for two rounds is pretty good. 100% chance. For himself to enter whatever that is, status ignoring enemies' attacks cannot dispel. Oh, he ignores enemies' attack for one turn. That's pretty good. Uh, especially if he goes first. Although he's an assaulter, so he's not going to go first. Decrease enemies' physical and strat defense by 20% for two rounds. Increase all allies' break rate by 60%. Cannot or can break limit oh you can break it so i think it's like 
I, I don't know what the limit is, 90% or something like that? So you can break it. So if you max it, it gets an extra 60%, which I'm pretty sure I'm max. I don't know if I'm max or not, but um, that's for two rounds. Restore own fury by 50 and everybody else for 30. That's actually pretty good. Pretty good assaulter overall, honestly. And it's got dot damage. I don't know. I think my current assaulter heals, so... Yeah, and then of course, town, come on, why do they do this? Hit to hit it just right for you can, so you can see the talent. Come on. Are you serious? Hold up. Alright, so I had to throw this in there extra because when I tried to use the skill, it didn't actually work. So here it is. And Sasuke looks freaking badass. There's Susano, so yeah, we'll get back into the video from here on. I don't know, I can't get it to, to where I can actually see it. So it's like cut off, it's so dumb. I don't know why they do this. Massive agility and force by percentage, increase 79% speed, 60% damage rate, something immunity rate by percentage. When the ninja is in battle, decrease the enemy's speed by 49%. 20% attack and 30% HP, ignore enemies, 50% control rate to self. In stun? I don't know what that is to enemies, 30% ignore attack abilities after receiving attack. Send enemy for one round, immune to damage, reflect, line, and death seed. Yeah, I hate how they do this. Like, I should be able to get on this side and it should pop. Oh, 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 we had it for a second. Oh, there we go. Increase a massive, <laughs> a massive agility and force by percentage. Increase seventy nine percent speed, sixty percent damage rate, fifty percent damage immunity rate by percentage. When there's a battle, decrease enemy speed by forty nine percent. Increase allies' attack and HP. Well, attack by twelve percent HP by thirty percent. Ignore enemies. Fifty control rate to self. Border immunity to enemies. Thirty percent ignore attack attribute oh that's crazy uh after receiving an attack 80 percent chance to stun enemy for one round that's pretty high 80 percent not 90 but still it's pretty high um because he's got hot damage and then he's got a chance to stun immune to damage or flag blind this yeah okay um that's pretty good honestly that is pretty good we do have a silver one so let's do that then we have a normal one for free, I guess. And then it goes to that. Um, wait, do we have another normal? Let me click it. I wonder if it'll take gold from us. Wait, did that take gold? Or was that free? Oh, that's gold attack. Oops, did I actually spend 50 gold there? No. It's 100. Oh. I think we had a free one. I don't know. Um, total Fury 250 currently. HP 500. <laughs> it says Thanksgiving hearts. Oh my god. 400. 3. Okay. Anyway. Uh, he's 35,000 points. I don't know how much that actually is. You got 10k for Chung Li and then you have some other stuff in there which you're probably not going to be going for and of course there are people already going for 48k you only need 35 so they went for the extra uh 15k to get the pet but if you're going for the character you're going to be getting the pet regardless that is going to be an extra 15k top 50 actually get the pet so that is pretty good uh currently we have we're going to say most of these people that are like 20 are going to probably get it Cause there's no way they spent that much not to get it um top 50 currently is 14k so they're almost at the 15k mark um i don't know if they're just going for the pet or if they're actually going for the character there's the pet attributes i have 50k i don't know if i want to change out assaulters or not hmm currently we have 20 or 250 I mean, I'm not gonna get top one or anything like that. we will probably end up like right here if I do go for it, but it is there. So, I mean, you can go for it. <laughs> this is the Thanksgiving one. Turkey level 10 can receive an extra 50% Thanksgiving hearts. 
Oh my god, I can't believe that thing is the turkey one. They didn't change it. Receive 100, per, or 100 gold per day for 20 days. Receive a total of 2,000. That's topping up 500, top up 2,500, top up 5k. That's crazy. Um. Oh, and then you can claim these, of course, when you reach certain ones. So there's that, I guess. But, uh... What else do we have? Oh yeah, we have some other stuff as well. We have like the Will of Fate, which you can go for and get some extra coupons. We have the Stamps Tree, which was already previously one of the things. A um, hundred of these for 50. I mean, 50 of these for a hundred. I'm actually just gonna buy those because it's only a hundred. I know I shouldn't be spending gold, but I kind of want it. Um, we do have the black market, but no one's going to be going for that when there's a new character. There's a few things in here you can go for if you really, really want to. Damn, a level 10 box. That was on a better price. That'd be pretty good. Um, this weapon. <laughs> I don't know if anybody's by that. We have uh, Obito here, which I think is my current Vanguard as well. And then uh, we have a few other characters if you guys want to go for them. We do have the set as well. Indro set. I don't know how good it is. 20k though. And then you're gonna have to refresh for each piece. Yikes, that's uh, not something you probably wanted to considering each piece is minimum like 20k for those. Um, Damn, you can get this down to 88. If that was 88, I probably would have bought it. That's a pretty good price. Uh, we have some other stuff in here. I just went to the bottom real quick because we're going to go through this set. Um, oh, they have the boxes. 450. All right, so the lowest piece. Well, this isn't going to be the lowest piece, but the lowest piece is still pretty expensive. Uh, we have the original price being at 20. And then... A discount of 2000 for 18 honestly it should be like 10 or 15k because you have to get the whole set and this whole set is going to cost you way way too much honestly um i don't know how good it is though effect of origin injury rate by 30 percent hp plus 20 percent. so that's a two piece four piece effect agility 18k damage rate 40 percent attack 30 percent. so that's a four piece set Six piece increase the success rate of control skills by 40% agility plus 30k after releasing scale poison the enemy and lose HP by 80% for two rounds. Wait, what? After releasing scale, poison the enemy and lose HP by 80% for two rounds. Oh, they lose HP or you lose HP? It says poison the enemy, okay. So it has dot damage on a set? Okay, okay. A six piece set is pretty good. That's probably why it is pretty expensive. So you got 18K for the belt. So already almost 20K. You got 20K for the boots. Honestly, I would, if you can get it like a two piece set, if you have the gold for it, if you're not going for characters or whatever, grab the two piece set, grab the boots and the uh, weapon. And just have that and try to get the other pieces later boots are going to be costing you 20k uh not to mention the prices for refreshing these so you're not guaranteed to get the weapon or the boots like you can get the hat or or the mask i should say or the helm or like the pants or the cloak i mean you can just get random stuff uh i wonder why these are this color and these are this because these are a little bit cheaper, although they're not really cheaper. Because look at this, it takes off 2,000. It takes off 2,000, so it's not really cheaper. Maybe a lower price, but it's not really cheaper. Uh, 17k for the cloak. How much is the one? 16k for the armor. 16k for the headband. 20k for a weapon. Um, on the weapon, honestly up to you look these are all the same price look 20k 20k but it has a different thing uh, so it's weird maybe they just wanted to do that to have every other one i don't know um honestly i would i would put it on my i would put it on my oh you can actually use it for an assaulter 
but of course you got the agility so I'd put it on my supporter but if you already have a really good set on your support you can put it on your assaulter he's got the damage rate attack plus the dot damage I wouldn't mind having this set although the set itself is gonna cost you a lot I mean just the boots and the the weapon is 20k I mean yeah 20k piece so that's 40k plus the refresh is probably a couple thousand and you're not guaranteed to get those pieces like this set is so expensive yeah this set is crazy 20 16 wait wait 40 16 16 17 and then I think the belt is 18 that is a hundred and seven a hundred thousand a hundred thousand gold to complete this set a hundred and seven thousand minimum not to mention the refreshes to get each piece so you're looking at like 125k set that is insane i don't even have that much oh my god uh let me know if you guys got that set i wouldn't mind having the set because it's pretty good but i don't think it's worth getting in that maybe it's in a different uh thing you can actually go for but um we do have other events going on money tree i believe was in the previous event yeah it was uh be quick i guess not really worth it honestly since they changed it they used to give us all of these for free now they charge which kind of kind of just makes it not worth it anymore but i mean if you're already spending you might as well just get the extra stuff um jubi presents group buy stuff like that but basically you got the black market for the set if you're gonna be going for the characters set's pretty cool um and then you have the character and pet plus the extra pet i don't know there's two different pets by the way so there's the 10k one in here which is chung lee and then you have this one here which is the the one you get for getting to 15k speed is i'm looking at the full attributes because this is the it's normal one 155k and then uh so it's going to be more defensive with 129 so basically 130k attack 1 mil HP, 150, less than 130, uh, 124, yeah, the, the new pet is of course going to be better, but uh, you can buy her for 10k if you wanted to, and then you have him for 35, maybe people are buying all three, because this is 45k and people are at 48, so maybe they got the pet, the character and then they're also going to get the extra pen because there isn't anything else to buy in here unless they're going for like changing this or like the truth seeker stuff maybe trying to go for the blood fang set i honestly don't know what they're spending the extra amount on uh yeah maybe maybe it's worth it to go get all three i don't know how much it costs but i don't think i have enough because I would have to keep an extra 50. I mean, I could keep an extra 40. It's probably going to be 40k, so I could spend 60. Um, maybe I could do that. Maybe I can get all three. You guys think it's going to be worth it? I mean, I do have characters I need to switch out for bees. That would actually boost my characters as well. Because I can get rid of some of these. I could definitely get rid of some of these. I can get rid of the cab for sure. And then, uh, I don't know if, uh, I mean, I can get rid of her. Honestly, those other ones are probably going to be better than the ones I have, even though, those, even though they're at level 13, because this one's speed currently is at 83. If I actually go check out the the speed on this one minimum it starts at 85 this one starts at 75 it might actually be worth to try to go for all of those although it's an assault I wish it, wish it was a support because our current formation is that so hmm Skill increases a certain amount of agility. Well, oh, nope, that's the talent. Attack all, attack all enemies. 360 girls for 80% chance to 
I can always spell all right, right here. Restore all enemy or all enemies. Restore all allies 120 HP. Increase all allies attack. Decrease enemies damage rate by 20%, 20% aid rate for two rounds, and clear the enemies. All buffs, including super dodge, restore self fury by 100 points, restore fury. Everybody else for 30. See, he's a healer, he's got 30%. Because I don't have a healer on. Wait, does she heal? I don't think she heals. Attack all. Come on, attack all enemies. 30% of the Where's a stunning? HP restore rate by 100%. No, I don't see anything. I mean, my va my Vanguard does, but I think he only does his self. Restore allies HP by 20% for one run. Oh, never mind. Maybe I should go for it, actually. Attack all enemies growth rate at 330. 70% chance to slice the enemy for two rounds. Restore all allies HP by 120 for a round. Increase allies attack by 30%. Decrease the enemies. I might actually go for it since we have two heals. Just go with the one heal on the, the vanguard and then... I really want to support though, but considering we'll get two pets as well, that would, that would increase my BP quite a bit. We're at 27 million, that would increase my BP by a lot, although we would have to wait another two months before we can get anything else, and I kind of uh, need to finish off some of the sets I have, um, and maybe some of the accessories as well, because <laughs> we have like random accessories hmm I might actually go for it let me know what you guys think I might actually end up going for this I mean we have till the 28th so I might go for it hmm I'm gonna put up this video. Let me know what you guys think and I might buy it and then make another video. Cause we still got a little bit of time left. We got three days. So I'm gonna let you guys, well, I don't know if anybody's gonna watch it, but if you guys do, let me know. I might end up going for it. If I do, I'll make another video. We'll grab both of the pets, which will be pretty insane. I should hopefully have enough. I mean, 60K gold, I'm hoping is enough for all of these. And then we have uh, a new assaulter and two pets. And then, uh, yeah, that would be pretty much it. I mean, we'll reincarnate. Uh, we're still working on our reincarnate on our second character, or on our main character though, or I mean, third reincarnate, because it's already second. Just gotta get to that level 50. But yeah, that's gonna be about it for this one. I know this is quite a lengthy one. Uh, it's just I haven't done one in a while and stuff like that. Um, and I am thinking about getting this uh, this character though. So well, let me know what you guys think. I might actually do what those guys did and um, drop 40. Well, I don't think we have to spend 40, 30, 45K, at least 45K to get both of those. And then we'll get the extra pet as well, because, I mean, currently, yeah, we're definitely probably going to get it. There's top 50, and it's not even, they're not even close to 45. They're barely at 15. Like, top 40, uh, 45k is top, s or 6. I hope I have enough for 45. If I don't, that would kind of suck. Let me know how much you guys spent if you guys went for it. Because if you guys spent like 60k, I'm going to do it. Because that's worth it. But if you guys didn't, then... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it might not be worth it. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll talk to you guys later.